Warm Verb, a versatile multi-effect from expert developer Tone2, is free with issue 234 of Computer Music Magazine. And this is no cut-down version. It's the full thing, as sold for £50. This creative, multi-talented plugin allows you to choose from over 31 effects. Ranging from epic reverb algorithms and lush delay types through to crunchy analog and digital distortion modes. Beautiful modulation effects such as chorus, flanger, phaser, rotary, and the lush super strings. Plus a MIDI controllable vocoder. Cut. Dub plate. Exclusive. Illegal. 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 Cut, that plate's exclusive, illegal. Talk box and pitch shifter. Yo, one and yeah, bass. Yo, one and yeah, bass. Yo, one and yeah, bass. Ring mod. <laughs> Tremolo. Autopan Stereo wideners and enhancers and many more incredible effects. You can combine up to four effects per instance with each slot featuring its own bypass and dry wet mix control. In this tutorial we're going to put warm verb sound design chops to the test by morphing this crusty breakbeat into this robotic melody. Warm Verb comes in both 32-bit and 64-bit VST formats for PC, but it's 32-bit AU and VST only for Mac, meaning that 64-bit OSX users will have to use some form of bridge plugin to get Warm Verb to work in a 64-bit door. We're using the version 2 beta of Sound Radix's 32 Libs. After scanning our plugins using the 32 Libs app, we can now flawlessly load up WarmVerb in a 64 bit Mac door. Once installed, set your door's BPM to 168 before dragging drumbreak.wav from tutorial files onto a new audio track. Insert an instance of WarmVerb on this channel. Then strap D16 Frontier and Barricade CM across your project's master output to increase loudness and prevent clipping. To get an instant feel for Warm Verb's capabilities, have a browse through the plugin's mammoth selection of factory presets. Head to the top browser section and click the drop down menu to select a preset from the categorized list. Or click on the up and down arrows to cycle through them one by one. Once you're done, punch the browser section's init button to initialize the plugin. WarmVerb's main center section is divided into a quartet of identical effect slots, 
meaning you can stack up to four of the 31 available effects at once. Click a slot's type menu, or use the arrows, to load an effect. Choose from reverbs, delays, distortion, modulation, spatial and other creative effects. Each slot houses empty macros that are automatically populated by up to four of your chosen effects available parameters. When adjusting these parameters, note that you can control or command click a knob to reset it back to its default position. Or you can shift click and drag to adjust the parameter in finer increments. Now let's apply Akai style metallic pitch shifting to our breakbeat. In the effect 1 section, select pitch shifter from the type menu. Then crank the tune knob fully clockwise to transpose the breakbeat up an octave. Now navigate over to the second effect slot and change type to the lush sounding vocoder effect. Set formant to minus 50%. Wave to Saw, Tune to B3, and Chord to Minor. To set up Warmverb's internal carrier oscillator. Warmverb houses a multitude of analog and digital distortion types, so let's use one of the latter to add an extra dimension of fuzz. In effect slot 3, change the effect type to Bitcrush. With drive at 42% and post damp at 49%. All four slots feature a mix knob for blending the dry and processed signals. We'll set slot 3's mix amount to around 50 50 or 12 o'clock for more subdued crunch. If you want to AB your processing, toggle the slot's bypass button to disable that effect. As three effect slots are now in use, we can hear all three effect slots' outputs in parallel. But this can be changed via the routing switch. Down at the bottom centre routing panel, you're able to flip between two signal flow topologies. When routing A is selected, the output of slot 1 is split and fed in parallel to both slots 2 and 3, before being recombined into slot 4. Press the B button to route all of the effects in series, meaning that the output of our pitch shifter is now routed directly to the vocoder for a more obvious robot break. Adjacent to Warmverb's browser is the equaliser section, consisting of three bands, a low and high shelf, plus a mid-range bell curve. Set all three parameters to roughly two o'clock, to broadly sculpt and enhance our singing beats tone. Now for some silky virtual ambience, courtesy of one of Warmverb's gorgeous reverbs. In the fourth and final effect slot, change type to Reverb Ultra. Then set mix to 9 o'clock. Size to 15. And pre-delay to 0. To change the pitch of the vocoder, you can always adjust the vocoder's tune knob.
but it's more fun to simply hammer notes on your MIDI keyboard. Create a MIDI track in your DAW, route its output into WarmVerb's MIDI input. Then play MIDI notes on this MIDI channel to change the vocoder's tune amount on the fly. The bottom left feedback section allows you to feed a portion of the process signal back in the chain. And this can even be tempo synced via the delay drop down. Crank up the feedback dial as you change pitch via MIDI to create screaming tuned tones. clip button lit up to prevent the squealing feedback from destroying your speakers and eardrums. To finish we'll round up the rest of the features we haven't covered. The top right mix panel houses volume, mix and bypass parameters for global control over the entire plugin. Browser features buttons for preset and bank, save, load, copy, paste, random and reset. If you get stuck for inspiration, punch the random button until you stumble across a random setup you like. Once you've explored WarmVerb's plentiful array of processors, head over to Tone2's website and check out their other awesome instruments and effects plugins, including their long-awaited wavetable synth, Icarus, available as a VST and AU plugin and also in standalone format. Icarus features wavetable technology that includes build-your-own resynthesis and vocoding processes, plus effects, arpeggiation, a mod matrix, and much more. Find out more at Tone2.com. Yeah.